Central Park West, 251. Eggs with Deller. See how this goes. Heard a lot about it. What a great city, huh? I go back a long ways with Rick Deller. One of the first times we hung out, we started having a conversation about his interest in building relationships. And uh, his uh, best way to do that is to have eggs with people. When I interviewed at, at Intellisys, I went to Rick Deller's house. We sat around the kitchen. Next thing I know, he's asking me what I want for breakfast. He's making up one of the best omelets, some of the fattest bacon I've ever had, some of the best bacon I've ever had. But that turned into a, a three hour job interview. And that's about almost six years to the day right now. After some late nights, a few more eggs, a few more eggs, and now I figure out this is where the master has mastered relationships. It's all about eggs. <laughs> For me, it's just a way to get more authentic. Uh, so I'll get these peppers and then getting to go deeper and know someone, you know, a little bit more because when you're sitting across from them every, you know, all the pretense is down. You just get to really, you know, talk about what's important. And it usually leads to something in business that's valuable. Gotta love traffic. New York City traffic, huh? Especially this time in Russia. You know, for me and for my relationships in business and in life, that's where kind of the magic happens and that's where it really comes out. I had to go to three markets. It's kind of what you do in New York City. Yeah. It's totally different. Check this out, man. It's uh, Peter Luger's established 1887. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're like pork chops. I love cooking. I love the alchemy of it, that kind of fusion of art and science and creativity that appeals to me. That's why I love to cook for friends. And it's no different in our partner communities and it's no different in our business. To create a great partner community, to meet them you know, on the way to success, that's, a, that's an alchemy. That's a, a combination of art and science yeah, and a lot of patience. Yeah, we're, oh, here, you want to see a little trick? Yeah, there you go. For a little flavor profile. Oh, nice. Also bacon piece in there. Absolutely. Establishing trust is so critical in business, um, certainly in, in the mentoring and coaching that I do. You know, obviously I've talked a little bit about eggs, you know, to create, you know, an ambiance where we can, you know, sit down and just kind of talk about stuff that's important and just eat some, eat some food together. For instance, Scott Evers, you know, Scott. Yeah, sure. I'll just text him and I'll go, Scott, Friday, eggs. Perfect. And he'll respond back, eggs. That's how I got to know some of those guys. Like, I didn't know Scott in the beginning. I had no idea he'd become a platinum partner with right. us when we first started sitting down right. and kind of bullshitting while we're eating eggs. Eggs is not a uh, tactic then, it's strategy. It's just, it's something you love to do. Yeah. How do you go about establishing trust with somebody? A way that I'll do that is just to try to be a little more vulnerable. Maybe I'll share something that I've done that was pretty embarrassing or really clumsy in business, um, where I didn't really bring Rick Deller on his best day. All right, so onions and peppers. We'll do some salt and pepper. Beautiful. I've got a little goat cheese. This stuff gets very soft, so I'll go ahead and toss it in the freezer for a few minutes. Perfect. And then you can slice it pretty easily. Have you noticed the same thing, like that breaking bread is just the, that's the way to do it? Barriers go down, you know? Jay Bradley always talks about uh, you can't really form a great relationship until you share some guilty secrets. You know, if I could give anyone advice, I mean, you want to be resolute in where you're going, but don't be tied to a strategy that isn't working. Fantastic. What do you think? Eating eggs with dough. All right, grab a fork and a knife. All here. right, yes, sir. All right, and I got napkins on can't the Can't wait to dig in. It's not unlike making an omelet. You know, I mean, if, it's, if you're burning the eggs, don't try to pass it off as something good. Scrape the pan, wipe it clean, put a little bit more oil or butter in it, and start all over again. You'll get there. That bacon, just wicked. That is incredible. That is wrong. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> that is just wrong. 